YouTube family. Seems that old block dudes are out here ready to profess. They gonna ride for their dogs, bruh. So you got a situation that old block dude let Muwap basically know that I'm gonna ride for you. I'm gonna defend you. I'm gonna respect your honor, bro. I ain't gonna let nobody play with you. And in this, he did do the unthinkable where he ain't let nobody play with his dog, bro. So O Block dude, I'ma fall back and let him respond, y'all. Salute, gang. You know, uh, O Block got ties with OTF, so. Oh, what's wrong, guys? There's a lot of money if these guys do get a bail bond. If so. Oh, what's wrong, guys? Let's go. Hey, throw something. Hey, throw something. Hey, throw something. I'm falling. Throw that bitch up. I'm falling. Throw something. Yeah. Whatever you got, man. There's a lot of money if these guys. Now you see the situation they were in. I'm gonna play. Uh, at the end of this video, I'll bring it back, but I wanted to speak to y'all on what goes on when folks in them is picking sides out here, bruh. When you pick a side, it causes a climax of a wave, my nigga, that causes people to think the only way to make it is dissing or dropping somebody. So these drills is getting more hectic out here. Drills is getting more brazen in broad daylight, and dudes is picking sides. Now, old block Duke, he got love for King Von, just like everybody else. He's been around Vaughn for a minute now. It's not a secret. All these guys have a genuine love for each other. And I learned this in the military. When you've been in a serious situation with somebody around you, don't matter if they black, white, none of that. That person is going to build a bond with you, bruh, like no other. That bond is going to be a strong one. And you're going to get the point, bruh. And that's what they got going on right now. It's a strong bond that people can't really internalize to what it is. So what they do is they look at the situation, the climates of it, and they break it down in their own way that's fashionable. Now, it's sad, unfortunately. While one man was leaning out the window, still shooting. In the melee, a man and a young boy, about eight years old, were both hit by bullets. One in the leg, one in the foot. Police say the child was rushed to the hospital. And the little boy was such a trooper that he didn't even cry, nothing. He laid there while this really cool nurse came and bandaged him up. And cop police tell me that while some of the gunmen did get in those cars and leave, others may have still been here at the mall when investigators arrived. At this point, they're still trying to account for everyone who was involved. Reporting live in Cobb County, Denise Stillen. Now, the Cobb County situation is more deeper than hit. You know, that's when you see the whole fiasco. And they're saying that, Book, if you don't know, that's the Cobb County situation with Buna, Buna 600, that is at the Georgia Mall, at Cumberland Mall, that is. So it's a lot of situations, y'all. And the back and forth is a little too much. What are you talking about? <laughs> In, in Atlanta? I've been living out here. <laughs> oh, your ass just don't come outside. I be outside, I just be, I be with slime now. Who thug? Yeah. I ain't never seen you at the studio. That's what I get. Man, stop playing. No, nothing, man. You bitch, uh, niggas be scared to walk around y'all block by y'all, so. Hey, my boy, stay up. All uh, right. They pulled off. They pulled out. What, that was the brown one? Where y'all go, though? We just walked the dust like girl. All right. They pull it out. Come on, guys. Hell, shit. Uh, I ain't care if I'm in LFL, too. So. What y'all on? How y'all coming? How y'all coming? That's how I'm moving. You know that? You better stop that motherfucker. 
Now, if you don't know what I'm showing you, man, like pay, like pay attention, gang. I'm giving you like the the complex to all this. Like remember, 051 Melly homies, gang, and 757, bro. All these folks, bro, they responded to this backlash uh, of of duck case being solved, and they they wanted to laugh at people saying who thought it was them and saying I told you it wasn't us. Cause if it would have been me, tacos, box. Oh, what do you think? Stay in the crib, too, on the way, bro. You know I'm hiding from. I don't mind fucking speculation. <laughs> Crazy. <laughs> yeah, I already know. I already know. This should be crazy. Motherfucker did all that. I don't cause the motherfucker ain't posting the motherfucker. That's what that shit came from. Motherfucker ain't posting. That motherfucker fired himself. Cause the motherfucker ain't posting nothing. We don't get no fuck. Yeah, man. I don't know why motherfuckers be putting shit together in their brain. Shit don't be thorough. But I know they said that cause, uh, the motherfucker ain't posting. And I never said fuck duck either. Gee, I ain't never say fuck him. I just said shit. What you mad cause your homie got left twitch? Shit. I ain't never say fuck shit. Motherfuckers love to throw sauce on shit. I know the was doing all that chit chat. Talking about wheelchairs and crutches. You know they was doing all that, huh? And that was a Drake too. Draco. The Draco. Niggas be putting all that raps. Putting Dracos and all they raps and on now you heard him talk about the wheelchair situation back and forth like a lot of people bring, um, bring that up that gets a little bit uncomfortable for a lot of folks you know like Moab had hassan campbell on clubhouse and people didn't even bring this up shout out the devil of the cloud chasing i'm like so how can you be running around talking about a case that you don't know about and he um and so a lot of people in the room start agreeing with me and um, my son got mad. Like, I'm not about to sit here and talk about the street with somebody who's not in the street. And he left the room. Well, you got to understand, son. You know, too, and it's on the internet. So all of them niggas should have been locked up a long time ago under the RICO Act. Like, you think, what? what's to that? Well, you, you know what you got to understand, son, right? In this world, nothing ain't going to happen until we make it happen. Nothing's gonna happen till we make it happen. You gotta understand, all these rappers that we discussing made it into the one percent, right? They would, they, 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 and like, and you gotta understand, son. When it comes, probably been watching y'all ass for a minute, and y'all thinking it's all like about. shit. Ladies and gentlemen, do me a favor. Let me pause it. It is not my audio. Dirk is by commercial planes and private jets. So you hear a lot of the, the engine is running. So you can't hear him too well, but listen to him. This video is after moments after Duck got killed. And this was the reaction by little Dirk. And that's why people were saying that. Now, me personally, if I'm Dirk's lawyer, you can't use this against me. What did I reveal? But people are saying this is the video. This video was posted by I. Oh man, we can take a flight. Jet life. Ass cheese pizza. Nigga got pizza. Let's get up with y'all in a minute. You got pizza on. Can't avoid sell the streets and my people ain't believe in me. I 
Talking to my dog. Man, shout out to Old Block Duke. Shout out to Moonwap and everybody. Meaning that whatever they discuss is what they discuss. We just letting y'all know. Folks in them said they got a hundred thousand dollar bond to release the guys. And a lot of these people, it starts with love, loyalty. You feel me? So a lot of people been through a whole lot. Long live everybody, man. Look, love your family, love your kids, and stay blessed, gang.